Kwale girls were the surprise package at this year's East Africa Secondary School Games in Rwanda. The Coastal Bay side defied the odds to emerge the regional champions, and as Abula Ahmed reports, they are hoping to dominate girls' football in the country. The Coastal Bay's team defied all odds to clinch the trophy, seeing off former champions Wieta Girls and Archbishop Njenga on their way to glory. And uh, we were taking our experiences of last year in Nyeri as learning points. We have had good preparation. We have given these girls a lot of exposure. Uh, most of these girls play for the Kwale County Ladies Soccer Team. And I believe that they have what it takes to play for the national team. That victory gave them a direct ticket to the East Africa Secondary School Games in Rwanda, where at the first time of asking, they bagged the regional title, stunning 2017 runners-up Kawempe Muslim of Uganda in the final. We were under no pressure, absolutely, because uh, being the first time, nobody was really expecting us even to go beyond the group stages. So we were basically taking a match at a time. What uh, makes the team do well? They do a lot of practice. Um, the coach is very strong. Uh, every time they're in the field, in the evening, in the morning, and they are fully supported. Their quest for the regional title was spearheaded by the tournament's top scorer, skipper Elizabeth Kiyoko, who has also represented the national team, Arambe Starlets. Kwa proof ya Kenya that hata kama watu ni wadogo selection na Rambe Starlet, usiangalie mtu ni mkubwa kiuji ama mtu ana miaka nyingi. Ball ni akili na intelligent. Usiona mtu amekuja pale selection kuanza kumidharau mtu haizi leta cross ya manini. Mchukue tu venye yuko. With an average age of 17 years, coach Mukasa Amboko believes his girls have what it takes to star. Abula Ahmed, KTN Sports.